Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can adjust the width of any column or the height of any row by placing your mouse pointer over any column or row until the mouse pointer turns into a double line with an arrow through it. Then simply click and drag to adjust the column width or you could also adjust row height. Now in Word 2003, XP, and 2000, you can also select the table and choose Table, Auto Fit, and then choose either Auto Fit to Contents, Auto Fit to Windows, Distribute Rows Evenly, or Distribute Columns Evenly. Now in this case, they're all grayed out. And if we take a moment and look at our table, you can see that I made a small mistake. I selected a little bit of text outside of the table. In this case, it won't allow me to do auto fitting because I have both the text, the actual document, and the table itself selected. Make sure that you, if you're going to work with the table, you have only the table itself selected and nothing more. So let's say we chose auto fit to contents. You can see that it took it and it fit it to the widest entry in each one of the columns. Or if we went back to table and auto fit, we could say auto fit to window, which just distributes it over the width of the document. And that might be a bit easier than manually dragging out the size of each and every column. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.